Hey guys, this is Keith and welcome to Let's Play Knit Underground, a new game released by Nicholas Nukrain, also known as uh, Niflis. Um, Niflis has made quite a lot of uh, pretty popular games, um, and Knit Underground is part of his Knit series, started with Knit, and then Knit Stories, and he just released uh, Knit Underground and sent me a message saying, Hey, would you like a game? So, because that's how Swedish people talk, I don't know. And, um... I looked at it and it looks amazing. So I figure let's just uh, let's play it. I had tried the uh, the previous knit games. Whoop! <laughs> I tried the previous knit games, uh, but I couldn't really get my my head around them. They lacked a certain amount of um, direction. There was like a compass that you could find and you could use, but um, that would just point you to towards the next thing. That you would have to find. That you would have to find. And was this something else? I know we were supposed to go up here. I'm just gonna check. No. Okay. Um, but the maps in Knit was so big that it, you know, by the time you actually, um, oh. <laughs> it, when you when you move a few screens, the compass would point you towards the, you know, something else, and uh, that would all be crazy. Now we're back here. But uh, we we talked a bit about it, and this should be there should be like better clear direction of where you need to go, and I'm actually pretty excited to play this. Uh, it looks gorgeous, absolutely stunning. Um, but it is a puzzle game, so you know, I I don't know <laughs> how well I'm gonna do. I know it says chapter two. I just want to check it out because I can. Maybe not. Actually, I'm not supposed to go up there anyway. So we'll go chapter one. As with more stuff. Yeah, let's go for the extras right off the bat. Credits, game demo, achievements. We might as well look. I'm not an achievement whore. You know that. Uh, oh, that was great. Great fun there. So we're playing as uh, me, Sprocket, M.I. She's a little sprite. And uh, she, as far as I know, she lost her memories. Um, and she doesn't speak. That's all I know. This is me. Not not me, but me. 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 So, hello there. Good sir. And that's Nicholas. I guess that actually looks like him. If you Google him. It pictures. Um, hi there. Now he's smart on that. Hi there. Welcome to Knit Underground. In this game, you play as a girl who has lost all her memories. Uh, no? You have no idea who you are or how you ended up here. Don't listen to me. He, he, don't listen to him. He's such a liar. Anyway, hi. My name is Me Sprocket. Right now, I need to see the fairies, so we should totally go to them. Okay. Mind if we say hi to my sister first, though? She lives up on the top path. I guess so. Do that. See it. Do you have anything else to say, Nicholas? Nah, we don't need to talk to him. <clears throat> so what's that? Oh, ha ha! Whoa! Whoop! Okay. So yeah, that's obviously killing us. Whoa! Ha <laughs> ha! Hi, sis. Hey, sis. Look at what I found. I can't do female voices. Come on. A rare human artifact. It automatically creates maps over places. Amazing, isn't it? I want you to have it. Yes, I know. I'm the best. You're welcome. You need it more than me anyway, so I'm not the one who goes spelunking all the time. So I was told you're going to the Fairy Springs. If you get an extra wish, can you ask for a name change? For me. That is. I mean, seriously, what kind of name is Re Ray? I get it. Do, re, me. So we're going to find Do at some point. In other case, see you around. Ahaha, we has map. So, yeah. Whoa. I still have the map. Okay, well, that's fine. Can we keep this, I wonder? For fun stuff. Oh, Nicholas disappeared. Okay, I guess we just start exploring a bit. Let's go up here. Whatever the hell that is. Oh, we can't. We need some power-ups. Okay. 
Well, there's an arrow there, so, I mean... Game saved. And that's all, I think. That's fine. Should we go down? Yeah. What's the worst that can happen, right? Death. Okay, so I can't get up there, but I can get back at least. I've got something here. A. It's a gun of sorts! Oh. Aw. Let's try and touch it, just to see. Yep, obliterate it. So even though I save the game, it sort of just starts me at the same screen. So that's kind of nice, I guess. Alrighty then. Now we're stuck down here. Oh, hello. Hey, Johan's the name. You can talk to me. You know, there's this thing called speaking. So you don't even have the decency to talk to me, yet you expect me to open this door for you? Fine, I was going to let you through for free, but you can forget that now. There are two candlesticks I want. You find them in the temple to the west. Bring them to me and I may reconsider. We don't have a choice, do we? Yep. So, uh, Johann Sebastian. Let's look at the map. Ooh. There's a bit up there. That we should can we port there? No. Ah, but it shows us where we need to go, so that's nice. Certainly something that the old knit games didn't have. What are these? Oh well. We should save. Okay, so that thing is probably dangerous. Let's find out just how dangerous it is. Yes, total obliteration. Not a problem, though. Oh, yeah. I'm not used to using my right hand to con use controls and stuff. Whoa! Although the controls are pretty nice, it's and, and it's nice that it's sort of fluent, you know? It's... there's nothing here. Well, hold on. Aha! It is what we're looking for! It is... What button is that? It looks like the backspace... I don't know. Um, <laughs> beats me. Wait, do I have other... oh? Other buttons? Escape? No. What? Oh, hold on. Keyboard! Quick map. Inventory. Oh, yeah, it's the tab. Doe. Mapper. Silver coin. And a candlestick. Okay. I can't do anything to them. Okay. Well, we've got one of them then. That's all nice and dandy. Now, don't die, Sprocket. Oh, close. <laughs> oh, Lord. Splat. Okay, so I guess we go down here then. It's a candlestick. It's weird, it says. Oh, it's because I can't go up there. Okay, fine. The music is pretty good. I can't go up there either, so guess we go down. There's something red. Whoa! That seems like fun. So do we go up there? Yep. What the hell? Okay. Guess that works. Let's get back to Johan. Yeah, I don't need to see the candlestick again. Now, there's a thing down there. And I'm guessing I'm going to die if I touch it, so let's not do that. Although, I do want to try one thing. Because we might be able to... Oh, that's a shame. 
Okay, well, let's go back to Johan. Johan. No! <laughs> oh, Lord. The music is great, but it's really loud. Obviously, you won't know that because I've turned it down by the time you listen to this. So, what's up there? I guess we're not supposed to go up there. Yet, or we can't, or whatever. Maybe the map will change. Don't, don't kill me! Ugh. Ahaha! I don't know what that means. I have no clue at all. But we can open the door. And that's where we need to go. Okay, and the, and the quest sort of lights up. So that's nice. What's that? You found the candlesticks? I guess I should let you through after all. Thank you, Johan. Oh, what are you? Huh. Hello? Hi, me! I see you met Johan. So, first he builds a stupid door, then he offers um, to open it for people. For a fee, of course. Can you believe that Moran asked me to fetch him the candlesticks? I got him candlesticks. Most people have the respect to not even touch things that belong to the temple. Johan asked me to steal them. I told Johan I'd put some ancient Tang... Tan... 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 Ga wa wa curse on him when I gave him the, the glare. Then I gave him the gear. Wor works on my... Uh, I suck at sneaking. How did you sneak through? I stole the candlesticks. Say hi to Madhuri for me. All right. So I know that sometimes there's secrets in the game. Like this. That's the only secret I know. And I'm not even sure... Oh! Haha! <laughs> and I'm not even sure where to go from here. Um, yeah. This was where we saw Johan. So let's... Oh, not Johan. Nicholas. Let's go back down. I don't think I'm supposed to be here just yet. Um, I could go up this way. I guess. It's got to be a lot of walking around doing nothing. Oh. Hello. Oh, the Mahu Mahui. Mahui. Me! Please don't tell me you're heading out again. You always make me worry. I tried to raise you, your sisters and brothers, to play music. Instead, you go on these expeditions to, well, I don't even know where or why. I guess this is what I get for marrying a sprocket. They say it's in your blood to put yourself in danger. It's less than a, a year until one of you is selected to ring the bells of fate. I'm so afraid that they will select you and not your brother. If you're wounded deep in a tunnel, you can't even cry for help. If you're chosen, you're not entitled to reject. Think about that. Okie doke. Should we go... I really feel like we should go down first. Ah, I guess. Who cares, right? Well, I care, but, you know. No. We we got up here through a secret. So let's, let's you know... I'm gonna go back. And go the way I'm supposed to go. Otherwise, we're just gonna... Have to backtrack anyways. Ha! <laughs> I can't even go back. I think. Yeah. Well, that's fun. So, first off, uh, the game looks beautiful. Um, the music is great. The, um... The characters does seem a little bit out of place. You know, they are... Okay, there was nothing down there anyway, so... I mean, the game is beautiful in itself. And then the characters look sort of... Made in Flash, you know? Pow! 
Yeah, this is the long way around. And it's probably nothing then. But we do need to find some fairies. As far as I know, the fairies can speak for you. Oh, I said hi to Madhiri. I forgot. No, actually, I forgot to mention you. So, sorry. <laughs> it just occurred to me. We can't do anything here. Guess we can't go up. We're supposed to be able to go down in here, though. Um, on this next screen. So let's do that. Hmm. There's a little stone up there. I don't know what you're for, but you're mine now. The guy who made this game also made Night Sky. I'm sure you, re you remember that Let's Play, if you've been around. So, what's with that outfit? You used to dress so elegantly. Do I know her? Also, um, I'm sorry for bringing this up, but I'm having fin some financial, financial problems. Maybe she's confusing me with my sister. Do you remember that small debt you owe me? Usually more talkative than this. Anyways, now would be a good time. Uh, would now be a good time to repay? Yeah, I guess. Um. So what do you need? You want something from down there, that's, that's fine. You can bloody go and get it yourself, can you? So this is... Whoa. This is chapter one. Okay, so this is to the outside, to the other side where mom was. I'm guessing that's mom. This is chapter one, and it's pretty big. and. A I wonder if my map artifacts also show paths opened by earthquakes. Yeah, I wonder if it is. Hmm. So... Well, there's always down, but let's try and see if we can reach that le Nope. Safe point. I'm not going to show every single secret in this game, because that would just be way too much. I don't usually go for, like, full achievements and stuff like that. But it will be nice if I can just play it a bit. Or complete the game, I mean. So where do we go? We go... It's weird, because it's also... Oh, it's probably because I can't go... Ah, I see. So, at some point there will be an earthquake, and I can get past that. Probably. So... Let's go... Let's go to the left. Oh, there's a little thing there. Ignore it. Okay, so I can't go that way. Let's go talk to them. Oh, we can't. And I can't go this way, either. So that's a pretty smart way of progressing people through the story. Earthquakes. Okay, there's a button there. Aha! It's on a timer. There's no way I can make that. Oh, hold on. Aha! So where do we need to go? We need to go either left or right. We can't go right, so we'll go left. Boop. So there's a robot that might try and kill us. Ah, get away, robot! Bad robot! <laughs> Um, okay, that's just for up, but I might as well just check it out. Yeah, there's nothing here. Well, 
No, we can't get up there anyway, so... Why try, right? Oh, I'm stuck now. Okay, so we're gonna have to go out this way. I think we can make it. Come on. Yeah. Not a problem. That looks like a secret. It's not. Okay, we're nearly at the uh, the quest item thingy. So we need to avoid this robot. Honestly, not a... Oh, it's a big jumper there. Not a problem. Slight problem. Oh, I should have been faster, though. No. Of course it could jump the gaps. I don't know how much reels that girl, but I'm pretty sure these gemstones are sufficient. And we can't get up there. So, okay, we got two gemstones because we picked up the other one earlier. That's what you get for exploring, Keith. Come on. So we just need to get back to that girl. Somehow. Um, right, well, I think we can just go up. I think we need to go up twice. What's that sound? Suddenly can't go up there. I like the controls. I really do. She's rather quick, this little one. But that's also good because in a lot of platformers, especially if you have to run around a lot, it can get really dreary to wait for your character to just, you know... Um, cross the screen. The water effect is a little bit annoying, I'll give you that. But I can live. Hello. War, are you offering me those gems? You're crazy. That's like what you owe me times 20. I have no idea how to properly thank you for this. You can open the way, thank you very much. Was there something to the, uh, it's just the same. Well, I guess we go save. I suppose. Not that it matters, right? But uh, I can't complain. So where do we go? I guess the world is... Well, there's only one way we can go. Hello, little monkey. Ollie, are you not a monkey? Pretty girl, hi. I was just at the fairy springs. I wished for something important, like a job that matters, or I don't know, something to do. The fairy said that my wish will come true if I'm patient and look for opportunities. You should meet them, they're so sweet. Well, apart from one, she was not nice at all. Okay. How do you like my voices? <laughs> Especially the female voices, I think I nailed those. Um, I don't know why I'm climbing up here. You don't really have any other choice, right? To go this way. We can go down. But I think we want to stay topside-ish, I guess. I don't know. I'm just exploring. Well, there's an arrow. And a pit. Let's go for the arrow. It's a safe game, or a safe spot. Let us go for the pit. I guess I'll go back this way. Robot. You bad. Whoop. <laughs> I can't do anything in here. Not today, robot. The game's beautiful. Absolutely stunning.
It's the same style of graphics as um, Night Sky. Oh, yellow! I don't know what yellow does, but I hope it makes me jump. Yep, makes me shoot up. Much like the red ones did, apparently. So I don't know what the difference is. Ah. Oh. Well, F you, man. F you. I guess I needed just to get out of here now. Whoa! Well, that's kind of nice. Can't get in there because I need to get that switch, but I can get over here now. And I can go up. Whoop. There's something blue. What did the blue do again? I forget. Alright, it makes me go sideways ish. That works. I am going to ace this game. Eventually. I hope. Okay, so far so good. There's red. What did red do? That also made me just jump, right? Aha! So there's a difference between red and yellow, obviously. Oh! Dang it! Well, we opened the way at least, so that should be nice. Wait. Okay. Well, yeah. That works. Just don't fail this again, Keith. More stuff to fail on. I guess if we go up here, we can unlock the uh, the door for when I fail. Not if, when. Ah! Whoa. I fell a little bit faster than I expected. It's all good. Everything is fine. Don't fall down, Keith. Oh, a little... I don't know what you are. And I don't know what this button does. I can sap them. I think... No, probably not. So what's all this? Was this just for not? For nil? At least, it is right now, right? Yeah. That was a nice waste of time. Fun little puzzle. But I'm sort of um, <laughs> missing the reward from that. Whoa. There will probably be something for this later. So, hello. An arrow over there, so that's probably another save point, I'm guessing. Yep. I might as well. Looks like there could be a secret up there. And I say that because I played Night Sky and I found all the secrets. Nope, nothing. Okay. Well, don't I look stupid now? Okay, what did blue do again? Okay. I 
feel like I keep getting sidetracked, but I'm not, you know, I'm not sure where to go. It's a little radio, I think. A poke. Used to scare off dangerous animals. A poke will make a scary sound when powered by a battery and the animals can be poked with its its stick. The poke is however missing this piece. The stick. Well, good thing we found the poke. <clears throat> oh, we can't use that there. We found a poke. And that's far there. Okay. I don't think we can be sidetracked much more. There was a pit that we didn't explore. But now I want to be sidetracked. I have no idea how to do anything here. Um, yeah, so I guess that's the pit we need to go to. Because we can't really go anywhere else. The map tells us so. Not that pit. Right? Right. This pit. It's also an area to the left, so I guess that's fine. That will lead us to a place we don't know. So I guess we'll check that out. Can we go in? Nope. Ah, actually we can. Imagine that. I'm just going to try and go into this house here. Nope. Hello? Oh, sorry. Ah, oh. I know where she probably went, and I'd go myself if it wasn't for the climbing. I'm going to try and... Okay, please help me. I need to find my daughter. Yeah, okay. She's always talking about the cave right above the forest. I think that's where she went. I hope she isn't hurt. Her name is Tova. Don't tell me it's where we just... Yeah, it's where we just were. Okay. I'm going to go down here. Hello? Well, fuck you too, then. Better check the houses, right? There could be something interesting in there. An item. But there's not. I'm getting really sidetracked from my quest here. And none of these guys want to talk to me. I am looting their houses, after all, but... Just ran straight through. Hello, visitor! Are you here for the fairy springs by any chance? Well, are you? The path is blocked by a door. You need to pay an entry fee. A valuable stone will work. Luckily, I have one which I will trade for, say, four human artifacts. That's a horrible deal, but I really need the stone. So... I should go for Tovi or whatever her name was. Maybe we can steal some from the houses. I got a theory that you might be able to... No. Ah, uh, I was hoping you could do that. What's this? Hmm. It would be nice to teleport between um, areas, uh, save points. Probably gets unlocked later. Otherwise, that's a lot of running. One stone or a coin. That's okay, too. You must pay to go to the fairy springs. Can't give up my coin. I need it for the fairies. So we need the. F okay. Well then, you're an asshole. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe that's just his job. It seems a bit excessive, though. Okay. That way goes to an unexplored. Per what would I need that for? I think I need it for in here. To go up there. Can we make it though? 
I shall try. Nope, we can't. Okay, well, we can explore the lower path. Oh, they shoot! And they miss. Whoa! <laughs> In your fa- Oh, there's nothing I can do up here. Hmm. Did you see that? Did you see how awesome I was there? Yep. Yeah. Um, no. Okay, I guess what we do is we go up for that quest. That would be the sensible thing to do. Sorry, just going through your house. It's not that far, I think. It is actually pretty far, I guess, but uh, that's fine. We could explore this part as well. Why not? That's very far down. And there is a little... Oh! Don't hurt me, bro! That's one human artifact. Fire extinguishers, that's the word. English is hard. So I wonder... Oh, we've got one. Well, I guess that's just... Foe shooter. <laughs> yeah, okay. If this game has too much running for us, I'm gonna <clears throat> cut some of it out. But for now, let's just enjoy, enjoy, enjoy the ambience. Is that the word? I don't know. So, we need to go... We need to go over here, go down. Well, we made the path anyway, so... So we did do something right, you know? So it wasn't all for naught. <clears throat> Although I would have loved to do it before, or, you know, have the quest before so I could get my reward instantly. So it's here. Tova's near, but how do I inform her mother? So nothing. Uh, guess we go talk to mom then. Hello? Tomoe finally came home. She says she didn't meet anyone looking for her, though. You never looked for her, did you? I swear I did. Hello, lady. Okay. Hey, thanks for not... Fuck you, man. Okay, so we can go... Up here. I guess that's our only choice. Why you hate me, robot? Why do they have robots that kill people? That makes no sense at all. Okay. Oh, that's a... Dude lady. 
There used to be a cave to my vi uh, to my village here. Looks like uh, an earth cave, cave blocker. Blah. Yet, I still call this my lucky day. I got a job offer from the internet. <laughs> they have internet? <laughs> We're going to capture one of the robots and figure out how it works. It's a dangerous job, so I had my doubts. Lucky for me, they offer a great advance at the ferry sp advice at the ferry springs. I met this really nice fairy who told me not to be so afraid. Fear and doubt is what causes accidents and bad stuff. Also, accidents and bad stuff is what causes fear and doubt. So, I mean... She said, with the right attitude, nothing can harm me. Now I'm going to take the job. You should go meet the fairies. They'll, they're made out of inspiration. Yeah. I'm trying to. Down another pit. What's the worst that can happen, right? Oh, I can't make that. And I can't get through there. Hmm. Robot. I can't go over there. It's nice that the map tells me before I try anything that will take like forever. Hmm. I guess this is the way out again. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, okay. There are people living here? What are you, freaks? Social outcasts? Bright light? No, we'll go this way again. <clears throat> Sorry. Ooh, dangerous robot. Whoops. Whoops. Not a problem. What's that? Robot centipede. A non-hostile microbot. It's a microchip. That's cute. Okay, well that's two out of four. So that's nice. We're making progress. And... We are stuck. So where, where can we actually go? I'm going to try and go to the fairy springs. Maybe this guy will let me let me get in anyways. With only two artifacts. Ungrateful little brat. Maybe this guy has... Nope, still nothing. One more artifact and I'll give you the stone. I thought we needed two more. Unless you want to have this this poke okay so it's got to be something with this part here what was that I I am going to look whoa <laughs> okay, so there's... Oh, there's definitely an artifact up there, I guess. So, we just need to find a way up through there. I just don't... Oh, wait, hold on. I think I might know. Because we don't have time enough to go out there, but maybe we don't need to. That was really simple and stupid. I hate this game. 
No, that was brilliant, man. So that's it. That's all I needed to do. <laughs> oh, Lord. So, I think just down here, I guess. Talk to the dude. You bought four artifacts. This one's broken, though, but that's okay. Here's your stone. Great. So just got a random stone, I guess. I guess we'll go save. Game shaved. Here you go, have your fucking stone. One stone. One stone coming up. Thanks, you may go to the fairies now. I hope they don't scream and fly away. They always do when I get there. I wonder why, mate. Maybe you can ask them why. Yeah. Because you're a greedy bastard and your hair is funny. So... The bear statue is blocking our way down there, so I guess we'll go up here and see what's up. Welcome. Offer a coin and state one wish. We cannot promise it will come true, but if your hope is strong, it may. You have to speak your wish aloud. Sorry, I cannot hear you. <laughs> oh, right. So I can take your... So I take it your wish is to be able to talk. I'm sorry, but we're fairies, not doctors. <clears throat> we do not have healing powers. But we grant many other wishes. Or can we? Shush, Celia. It's amusing how people think small... Small plus wings equal mag equals magic powers. The people jester, the jester itself can give to people, can, the jester itself can give people the strength to make their own wishes come true. Haha, <laughs> as if. Either way, it's easy money for us. Celia, we don't have a business if you tell this to every person who comes by. Perhaps it's, it's about time we actually help someone out. You go with the woman. Yeah, and help her how? You go figure that out. I'm, I'm imagining her like some ghost thing. Okay, I'll be her shadow. You too, Dora. Follow the lady, check. Okie doke, so we got some fairies. A sun fairy and a moon fairy. Um, the thing about us fairies lacking wish granting powers. Would you mind keeping quiet about that? Oh god, sorry. I did <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, okay. <clears throat> oh, we got, like, the little fairies following us. That's a nice little effect. Sorry about the anticlimax. You know, we really do help people. If people believe anything can happen, even, like, super impossible things. Dora, give her a break, will you? Does the bear statue disappear? So, oh, you're going back home then? If you came from the, the west, I don't think you can backtrack. There's a path to the east, though. If the... There's a trick to getting this door open. I don't think it works uh, with the other doors, though. Here, let me try. Haha! <laughs> well, aren't you special? Okay, down, I guess. Whoa, trippy! This is some human device. I, we have no idea what it's for, but we often use it as a path. It's safe for us fairies, but some strange things happened when two sprites were inside the device at the same time. I don't see anyone around though, so it should be good. Well, that might change in a moment. Well, who else would be stupid enough to... I don't know. I'm stupid enough, I guess. And then there was an explosion. <laughs> oh, come on. There are more chapters. Alrighty, then. That was chapter one. So, let's move on to chapter two.
chapter two that we already visited, visited, but uh, obviously we didn't go in there. That's fine. Chapter one was pretty quick, but uh, chapter three is apparently ten times as big as chapter one. So that's that's crazy. Oh, I can control this bouncy thing. Whoa. Hey, hey, hey! Am I the bouncy thing? Electric bouncy thing. <laughs> okay. Oh, I can hold it down and it will bounce less. Whoa! Wait, I saw a thing up there. Oh, I can't get up there. Oh, well. Oh, up will make me bounce. Well, thanks for that, game. Nicholas, I had no idea. You're a ball! I've heard the stories. A ball disabled a huge bomb. In this lab. Yes, the bomb's still there, sleeping. The ball! It happened a thousand years ago. Was that you? I don't know, I can't talk. So, it might be me. I thought this game was about me. Oh. What is this? Hmm. <laughs> I don't think I'm supposed to be in here just yet. We'll go in and down. So robot. I can take care of the rope. I could not take care of the robot. Hmm. So, okay, this robot that only fires sometimes. I get that. I don't think we need to deal with it though. Water is no bother. Drink. <laughs> oh, great fun. Oh. I want to go up here. Oh, I can't. No. Ah, probably going to make the jump anyways. Probably nothing up there anyways. Right. Game shaved. Whoa. Oh, A. Ooh. Ah. Oh, hey. Well, I am a quick learner, I think. Um, maybe not. <laughs> There was another way, wasn't there? I'm not sure. I'm going back now to find out. Nope, there was not. I don't have my map. Oh yeah, there was another way down here. So what was the point of that? Just to teach me how to do stuff? Oh, easy now. A uh, ball? But how? Man, he looks trippy. Never mind. I bet everybody who sees you goes, Oh my god, you're a ball. How can this be? You must get that all the time. Anyways, door. I wake up this morning and it's just there. What's the deal? Despite have bio biological earl urge to build them? Reading is hard. Guess what? Don't care. I've got this tool that opens them all. It's here in my pocket. No, it's not. Damn it. Come on then, help me look for it. So I got it. Oh, now we got stuff. There's a question mark up there. So I guess we go back. So what's the deal with me then? By the way, I have this map thing. I mark the places where the door tool might be. Why did human 
uh, humans built such a small map thing? I don't know. They were giants, so it makes no sense. Maybe they did it only because they could. Now it's mine. Okay, we're gonna go back here. Ow. So now I have a little fairy. Okay. Aha! The nest! These, those birdies took it. Let's have a look. Oh, it's not here. Well, big surprise there, eh? So this ball obviously reminds me of Night Sky. Okay, don't try to make this jump. Just found out, uh, I, I just found you, but seriously, that doesn't mean I want to watch you die. We'll find another way. I can make this jump. Are you out of your mind? Well, you're still alive, I guess. How can anyone survive without wings? Don't ask me. There we go. This jump is impossible. I guess that's it. No way to proceed. Oh, I want to bounce. Oh, I want to bounce. Like this. Haha. -ha. Because I saw the trailer. Some more distance on this. There, whoops. Hey, ah. I have an idea. It's probably going to kill me. Yeah, I didn't do anything. Ah, like that. Okay, hold on. Hey, Epsilon. <laughs> I lost something. Epsilon the foot? I don't know. I know your name is Circle. <laughs> Uh, but if I but if I use it, the ball here will think I'm talking to him. Or her, I suppose. No, wait, him. It's a he. How do I know for sure? Well, I don't. Paperclip. Exactly, the door tool. Can you look at it? Can you look into the disorder? See where it is? What does that mean? In my pocket? Double checked already. It's in your crotch. It's not there, really. The tool is big, not something I'd miss out. Anyways, need to keep looking. Bye. So where else then? So, no tool. We're locked in here. I'm not really, because I can fly uh, the route to the, through the lab. Guess you're stuck, though. Sorry, dude. Nothing I can do. Fairly certain the foot thing didn't lie to us. Why would it lie, you know? Well, I guess I can go out through the lab as well. Hmm. I want to go down to the house again. Have that ferry. Um. Oh! Okay, now the door is open for some reason. Ha! That's quite Dussex Machinima. Machina. Yeah, quite do sex. I don't know. I don't think I got that reference. So, are you intelligent? Yeah. I mean, you don't speak, so it's kind of hard to know if you understand me. Maybe I'm just, like, talking to an animal. Yep, that's most likely. I'm not an animal. 
Guess I need a name then. Bolly? Nah, that's dorky. Ball. Wait, I got it. Bob. Of course. Because I'm Rob and it rhymes. Bob and Rob. Okie doke. Let's just get to stand still here. We can't go either way, so I guess down is the way to go. Are you hungry? Hey, we should see my girlfriend. She's pretty good at knowing stuff. I mean, she's probably she probably knows what um whatever you are, eat. Probably to reach her place, we need to go through two doors. So I really really need that tool. I have some ideas where it might be. I'm marking the places on the map. Oh, turtle. Turtles. Okay. We got several places to go. Guess this is as good as any. Boing. I'm a home worker here. These guys don't care. It's a bouncing ball, but they don't mind. Oh, come on. <laughs> There's something supposed to be something here then. Uh, hey Lisa, check this out. What is that? This is Bob. What does that thing eat? Fairies. <laughs> no really. Uh, no. I really have no idea. I'm trying to find out. Your girlfriend knows like everything. Just ask her. I'm trying to, but doors. You're the one with the utility. Oh, so I didn't forget it here then? Nope. Damn it! Okay, well that's... Whoa! One way. I guess we will continue on this way. It probably goes around in a circle. Does this hurt me? Only one way to find out. Yep. Oh, it still hurts me. Careful, Bo Bob. Whoa! <laughs> So I don't think we can go up the... No, we can't. Ah, robot? Okay. Whoa! I meant to do that. It's fine. Save point over here. There's nothing, right? Yeah, there's nothing. I'm gonna attempt to go back up here now. And I oh, oh piece of cake. Oh, okay. There's something down here. I may have forgotten the tool here. It, this is a secret place where fairies throw parties. And you know, party is my middle name. Rob, party, whatever. No, really, party is literally my middle name. Robert Party Tofu. That's toy, so I could use it as a joke. Like, if somebody says, hey, wanna go to this party? And then I respond, party is my middle name, and it'll actually be true. Problem is, I hate parties. Lots of people, scary stuff. Last time I went uh, to one was here. Girlfriend's birthday. She was like, it's <laughs> it's all going to be fine, you'll do great, blah, blah, blah. So I pulled myself together and went. Tried to be social, made some, made some jokes. Offended her friend by mistake. Things went downhill after that. Seriously, be glad you don't understand people. They're scary. God, what a disaster that day was. Anyways, let's see here. Nope, door tool isn't here. Well, there's the downstairs as well, but I don't know. I guess this is where we need to go. I want to check upstairs here. If I can. Ah! Hey, 
I meant to do that. I don't think I can get up from here. I can, and I will. Robots. More robots. I am meant to do that. This might actually be the way to go. I'm gonna backtrack a bit just to see what's up here, if anything. Map is big though. Oh, save point. Boing, boing. You know what? I should. Okay, I'm gonna go this way just to get the map. And then I'm gonna go towards the. Um, The, the place where the tool might be. Because, I mean, we will probably explore the rest at some other point. Let's just go the most obvious route. Without getting killed by robots. Aha! Ha, we have been here before. We are Sabol in the area. We have previously visited Catherine. You home? Hi, Rob. Mom's on the shower. Whoa! What's that? It's Bob. Be careful so he doesn't bounce on you. Hello, Bob. What do you? Why are people so preoccupied with what I eat? He doesn't understand us. Bob is like an animal. Oh. So how, how, how goes the flying? Yesterday, I was in the air for 10 seconds. Wow, well done, Miriam. Actually, I came by because I may have forgotten, like, a key here. That sweet-ass thing on, that can open any door on the planet? Yeah, exactly. Hey, who told you words like that? My sister. Oh, like, yeah, no, me, Miriam, I don't know. I don't think I've met her. Are you going to tell mom I said sweet ass? Please don't. It's our secret, so... Do you know if the door tool is here? It's not. Aw, oh, too bad. Bob and I have to leave. Say hello to your mother for me. Okay. Bye, Rob. Bye, Bob. So, where do we go? Can we even... Get out of here? Huh. Okay, we can go down. Whoa! So I have no idea what we should do now. How about if we head for the doors and wait for another Deus Ex Machina? I meant to do that. Okay, so the doors are down there. Ow! Hey! Totally meant to do that. I'm doing this on purpose so you can see how this works. Ha! <laughs> Survival of the fittest, baby. So, down this way. Ow. I think it's pretty weird that we're not playing as me anymore. Whoa! I suppose we'll save. And go down. Thank you. 
Uh, oh, oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, the gods are on our side today. If we wait, I'm sure something will happen that will make this door less closed. Any second now. Come on, door. I command you to open. Uh, no. Aha! The other pocket. Because I, I normally put the tool in the left one. Idiot. So we had that all along. Almost there now. We need to go to the upper... Uh, Wait. You can't fly, right? This makes things complicated. Okay, so if we go downstairs, there's a human thing there. A tube we can go through. It's a bit dangerous. Actually, let's not use it. It's a, probably a bad idea. Oh, I get it. Because I've seen the trailer. And then there was an explosion. Right. Okay, I promise the ending will be in the next chapter. Uh, it will be much better. And before you dig into dig into chapter three, it's time for an interlude. Okay, we're not done yet. I'm pretty sure that kills me, that red stuff. So chapter 2 was pretty short, I think. I lost track. This is not a challenge. Come on, Nicholas. Uh, hello? Hi, lady. It's Tova. Hi there. Wait. Wait now. Oh my god. I can speak. So, that's what I sound like. You're like Keith. <laughs> Where are you? Where are we, by the way? We're in the sky. Hi-ho. <laughs> Hi-ho. Blah, blah, blah. Blur. Blur, blah, 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 blah. Booey, wooey, woo. Dundee, dundee, shwoop, de bloop, la, 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 la. Schwoggin, bloggin. Ha-ha. I know. I mean, if you just got your voice, I get it. Okay, I'm gonna try to do this and then and then die. Because it seems obvious I need to go up and then that way. Easy peasy. Ow. And up. Whoop! Yeah, there we go. It's cool, it's cool. Not a problem. There's no map. Good morning. No. Time to get up. Door, not now. I'm having an amazing dream. I can speak in it. Come on, wake up. She looks really tired. Poor me, she stayed up super late last night. We're running late for the Muradis 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 Temple, though. Let us sleep. It's not like the world would end if she doesn't get there. Actually, that's not true. All right, guys, that is it for this Let's Play, which turned into a Let's Try. Uh, we completed Chapter One and Chapter Two, which was great. And then I started recording Chapter Three, and after recording for like two and a half hours in Chapter Three. I realize this is next to impossible to, to do a let's play off because, and I'll show you, right? I'll just give you a little uh, little hint of what chapter three is. I'll, I'll go in and I'll show you how much I've played. Uh, this game is really big. What, what you've seen in chapter one and two is nothing compared to, I mean, look at this. This is the map that I've discovered so far, right? And the dots are some bells I need to ring and that's fine. This is this is impossible to let's play uh, or let's play properly. I could just keep doing this and then cut it into 10 minute segments, but nobody would want to watch that. I do, however, encourage you to go to the Greenlight page, get it on Steam. If you want to play this, you know, go buy the game. You can find a link to the website in the description below. Uh, the real stuff starts happening here because in, in Chapter 3 because you can, can combine. You, you are... You can switch between being me and being the bouncy ball Bob. 
um, which is fun, which which kind of great to do. And there's lots and lots and lots of stuff to uh, to go and, and look around at. Um, this is the majority of the game right here in this chapter, and I had barely scratched the surface. I've, I've surfaced after two and a half hours of playing just chapter three. So thanks for all. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.